Good morning. Good morning, guys. We're here in the Medical City Clark. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. So it's Friday today, and the kids have their checkup and vaccine schedule. I am not sure if what vaccine they're going to have. But yeah, we're actually a bit early, like 15 minutes. Easily. Yes, that day. So yeah, we're a bit early and I think like 30 minutes early. Oh, thank you, darling. So I'm with Tala and we're just going to go inside. And I don't have a mask, so we have to get in the front desk. Hope it's for free. So there is Daniel and Saren. Hi, darling. Last time we bring um, Saren here in emergency and... That is one of the life update actually. Um, Saren have like an accident um, in the house when she broke the the glass and uh, she slipped it off in her hand. Yeah. And then another accident again happened in Ortigas. Remember a few weeks ago? Yes. So yeah, we're just going to go inside guys. It's very sunny today. And... Oh, my kids doesn't bring their hat on. Mommy forget again. Is she? Yeah, so hopefully they're not gonna have fever after vaccine in it, love. Do you remember this place? I'm just gonna put my mask. Just gonna put our mask, just a mask in the hospital. And mama. Thank you. So this is Medical City Clark front desk. Then we're going up. Dami pa lang ano you know, injections for the kids. I am not sure what age they're gonna end this um vaccines. Making a new friend. Oh, a new friend. Good job. Wow. Good job. Let's wait then. Saren. Saren. <laughs> Darling, it's okay. Wait. Sit, sit. sit. <laughs> Good job. Oh, broom, broom. Are you ready to see the charm? <laughs> Saren. Saren, what's your weight? 10 kilo. Huh? And Tala is 10.5. Good job. No? <laughs> show, show Saren. It's okay, darling. Well done. Well done. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You see, all done. All done. It's okay. All done. It's all done. All done. All done. You see, finish. They won't have fever. This is their booster shot for that. Hi guys, we're just finished. Hi. <laughs> and then um, we're about to go to the parking, and um, they just finished the vaccine, which is a. Uh, blue booster blue booster shot yeah so they get blue booster shot and then yeah doc mentioned about um what was the no now uh viral not viral um the pertussis so she said that there you're not gonna worry about that because you're up to date for the vaccine yay so now um we're going for lunch and then we're going to item market. Yay! 
Going now to the Ata market. Yarns, that's it. We're back at home and Iyan bakit natin yung mga na bili namin sa Ita Market. Um, I'll show you first uh, what we bought before I I'll reveal how much it cost, de ba? So first we have a banana sa ba? Ita Market guys is located in Clark. Um, it's near to Han Hotel. If you are familiar around Clark. So, andun lang siya. Malapit lang siya sa Han Casino Hotel. So, every Friday, uh, pumupunta talaga kami sa Ita Market to buy some goods like this. Kasi um, our kids actually love um, vegetables. Every Friday, yun nga, pumupunta kami sa Ita Market. And then, nagkatao naman na kanilang vaccine today. So, that's in Medical City, Clark. Before, ang check-up talaga nila and vaccines are in Cardinal Santos, which they were born. But since we transferred nga here in Pampanga, the nearest um, hospitals or uh, the dedicated hospitals that good, you know, quality and stuff like that is the Medical City. So, um, I think it's almost a year that uh, we've been here around Pampanga. So, yeah, so far so good naman kasi ang bait naman ng kanilang head, yeah. So, yeah, we're back on the uh, unboxing <laughs> from uh, what we bought in Ita Market. And then I get another banana. Um, I forgot what, it, what it's called, but yeah, I like this as well. And the kids. So, we have three bananas, bunch of three bananas there. And I bought papaya. So, um, the kids have it. If I'm, yeah, I act, they actually uh, taste papaya before. But uh, this is my first time to buy um, papaya in Ita Market. So, um, just wait a little bit more days to write this papaya para mas masarap. Masarap. And then, I bought some mangoes. So, just take it out from the plastic kasi gagamit ko pa itong mga plastic na to. So, we have mangoes. So, we have banana, papaya, and mango. So, next is we got tomatoes. Hindi ko na muna siya ilalay kasi diretso ko na sa page. And then, we've got potatoes. Um, yung ginagawa ko dito, minamash ko siya. 
And then I mix with eggs and um, all flour. All flour. All purpose flour. So, so far, gusto nila yun. And um, I normally buy cauliflower or broccoli, but this time walang available. Next is sayoti. Sayoti is one of my kids' favorite again. Um, alam nyo, swerte ko. Swerte ko nga guys, eh, kasi yung mga kids ko, walang kaarte-arte sa gulay at saka sa prutas. Um, hindi sila mapili. Um, actually, ang paborito nilang kainin is yung mga plain lang, like gulay, ganyan. Pag pinakain ko sila ng mga sweets, minsan ayaw nila. Um, parang tinatapo nila. So, that's the good thing when you look after your kids, Char. <laughs> Kasi talagang, ano, ma ma hands on mo kung ano yung papakain mo sa mga ginakit mo. Alam mo yun. Got some carrots as well. And this, again, this is one of their favorite. Um, actually, ang dami lang paboritong mga prutas and gulay. So, isa yung carrot. And then, I bought a watermelon because it's very cheap compared to a market like other market na high-end. Mahal talaga ang watermelon. But, in Ita market, it's only 150 guys. Whatever size is it, whatever weight it is. Kasi hindi na wini-weight ni ate. So, every piece there, what is available there, you have to choose, you just have to choose lang. And it costs you 150 each. I'm not sure if it's cheap, but for me, I think it's cheap because as per checking with the other market, gosh, mahal, like 300 plus, may 500 plus pa nga eh. So, yeah. Then, I bought some little bit of ginger. Because I normally um, mix it when I boil their vegetables. And then, I bought some little bits of garlic. Kasi paubos na yung garlic ko. So, yun. I think, ito na, ito na yung nabili ko. Then, I'll show you pala na ay binilo yung kaming ano, cow's milk. Just wait. So, this is the cow's milk. Um, it's a new venture. Um, I'm not sure if may branch na sila, but uh, they're selling it in the meantime in in Ita Market. So, so far, so good kasi na-try na namin to before. And um, yogurt or other milks are my kids' favorite. So, hopefully, maubos din nila to agad. Maliit siya. Wala silang malaking size na available. But normally, they have. So, yeah, I choose strawberry yogurt and uh, mango yogurt so the company is called Puklo so yeah very local ito na yung napamili namin actually malaki yung saba banana nila yan and excited na ba kayo kung magkano yung total nito lahat hmm. it's all cost 950 pesos yan 950 pesos guys I'm not sure if it's cheap or it's expensive. But um, I feel it's quite expensive this time. I don't know why. Kasi normally kasi ang mga nagagastos namin doon pag namimili ako mga around 500, 6, tapos maximum na yung 700. But today, mabot kami ng 900. So I'm not sure if it's because of this and this. Kasi ngayon ko lang to talaga bumili lang mangga at saka papaya so yeah, um, magpipil lang ako for my kids' dinner, which is yung sayote, carrots, and potatoes. So, buboyad ko lang siya with ginger. The veggies that I'm gonna cook is actually good for one week. So, um, sometimes they finish it early, like mga five days, ganyan. Uh, but, um, binabudget ko siya na aabot siya ng a week kasi 
um, every Friday nga kami pumupunta ng Aita Market. So, I'm just gonna boil sayote, carrots, and squash. Potatoes na din para isahan na lang. Alam mo yun. Um, hirap mag-manage ng kambal, guys. Um, just for their siguro uh, milestone update for my teens, um, they know now what are the body parts. So, if you ask them, where is your eyes, nose, head, knee, toes, they know it. So, that's one of the milestones they have now. And um, they can actually uh, walk and run very fast without our help. So, it's a bit, I know, uh, mahira for us kasi yun nga, full-time parents kami and we don't have yaya and anything and anyone. So, talagang hands-on kami ni Papang. Which is mahirap kasi pag nasa labas kami, uh, mas preferred kasi mga bata ngayon yung magtatakbo-takbo. And dun kami, yun dun kami nagsistruggle. So, unless merong um, high chair sa restaurants, kasi kung wala, talagang mahirap guys kapag nakasabak lang sila sa amin. So, yeah. Third, um, Tala is actually starting mimicking. Um, I think she's about to start talking. We can speak mama now. <laughs> Finally. And, and um, yeah, Tala can mimic your, what you're trying to say. And sometimes, kung may gusto siya sabihin, talagang, talagang parang gusto niyong magsalita, alam mo yun, pero hindi niya lang ma into words. So, I think that's part of the milestone for my kids. Um, by the way, guys, um, Saren and Tala are um, 16 months now, if I'm not mistaken. October sila pinanganak eh. 2022. So, 16 months. Um, so far, okay naman yung kanilang mga milestone. Kung baga, ano naman siya, match naman siya doon sa buwan nila or taon. So, yeah. Some animals, some fruits, they know na. And if they want, like, pandesal, they're just gonna go every morning sa kitchen and um, parang ituturo nila yung pandesal. Kasi yung pandesal namin, may place lang siya saan nakalagay. So, they just go direct there and parang they are asking you to give them pandesal. So, that's very cute actually. And then, yeah, so, it's really time flies as they say. So, most of ng mga parents na dati pa, totoo pala talaga yung sinasabi nila na ang bilis na ng araw pag pag meron kang baby, tapos narinig ko lang siya before nung mga infants pa yung mga baby namin. Sabi nila, mabilis lang daw yung araw. And I actually feel it now. Yeah, ang bilis lang. So, yeah. Dito na lang muna magtatapos yung aking life update, guys. And hopefully, magagawa ko to every once a week or twice. Kasi mahirap talaga kapag may kambal, guys. And yun, um, full-time mom pa ako. And this is my Tala, the one who can mimic na. She actually loves mimicking. And by the way, guys, I separate their playpen into two. Kasi um, lagi na silang nag-aaway, nag-aasara, nagkakagatan, naghihirap, hihilahan ng buhok, and palo-palo, ganyan. So, talagang kailangan ko siyang i-separate. And then, this is my Sarani. Sarani is adventurous girl. She loves climbing. She loves jumping, dancing. Aren't you? So, si Saren, <laughs> ang ano lang kay Saren is uh, prone siya sa accident. Kasi nga, sobrang adventurous. Na sobrang siya adventurous, guys. Um, like, yun nga, sabi ko two weeks ago, nagkaroon siya ng accident dito sa bandang chin. So, talagang careful kami kay Saren. Pero hindi naman talaga natin may uwasin ng accident, di ba? It's okay, darling. I'm just gonna cook your dinner and some of your foods in it for a week. So, they're not gonna have a nap in the afternoon anymore. They just have one nap in the morning that could last one and, one and a half or sometimes maximum two hours. So, um, isang nap na lang sila kada araw kasi um, we've noticed kapag dalawang beses, like kung magnanap pa sila sa afternoon, um, mahirapan kaming patulugin sila in the night time. So, yeah, I think I have to end this video na. Okay, end ko na to. Dahil, um, wala na sa mood si Saruni. Saren, kiss mama. Kiss mama, anak. Yeah, she's not in the mood. 
Kala, kiss mama, kiss. Mm. Oh, finish now. Kiss mommy, Adi. Mama, mama, mama. Then Hari, Hari, what are you doing? No, Tene. This is our first baby, Hari. Yeah? But no time anymore in it because mommy and daddy are very busy with their sibling human, aren't you? Hmm? Hmm? And, and Lace is hiding under the table. Okay, so bye bye now, guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Please like and subscribe to mommy's channel. Blankies. Blankies. Oh. Blankies. Blankies. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> Very good. One more. Oh. <laughs> You lang. Bye. Bye. Bye.